Well, I'm here to talk about my necklace that I finished a while ago, and it still needs a little work. Um, I wanted to talk about some of the mechanics behind this and uh, how the clasp works. But anyway, you can see that the flowers, they kind of rotate, and the leaves also move on the flower. It's pretty cool. Um, so what I did on the back here, so I have this little mechanism. It's a little, first I, I soldered down a piece of bezel wire with my Bennett. So it'd make a tube like, and then I just soldered it down. Then I put the loops on. When I put the loop through, um, I made sure not to solder it because the leaves had, the round part of the leaves had already been soldered. Okay, so. Then that was, the loops then were soldered after the leaves were on each side. So these things move around really nice. Um, and that kind of helps um, when you go to put it on. You have to lay it all out like this. Let's see, and then you pick up each side of the chain, which I can't do because I'm holding a camera. And then you just pull it up and put it on. And it's a choker. You can make it as tight as you want. It's one side of the chain. I have to fix the chain. I left out a small loop somewhere so it doesn't match the other side. Anyway large loops on the end and then this is the how the clasp works this clasp is just a little T and it's on a figure 8 all soldered together so to put this on I'm gonna have to probably put my, set my camera up somehow so this works let's see here Alrighty. So the way the clasp works is you just have this little guy here. You put it around your neck while you're holding it. You run it through the loop and you pull it until you feel it resist against this other loop. See? Here. And then once you let go, bam, that thing is in there. And it's really like not going to come loose. Because each side of it is, when it hits here, this can't pass through. And it works that way both. And that is how to make a proper one. And the little uh, figure eight here helps this thing to be able to go in deep enough. And to also be able to, when you want to take it off, you grab that, pull it through, boom. There you go. Not the greatest clasp I've ever made, but I don't make a lot of clasps. So that is my little video on my necklace. Buy it. There's not another one like it quite in the whole world. Talk to you later.